So I just got this email that I'd like to send out as an announcement and put up on the web page, and it's a PDF. And one thing that is great with Google Sites uh, in combination with Google Drive that you can do is embed a PDF into the site. And so I want to show you how you could go about doing that. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and close this out. And this is the file here, Thanksgiving Community Resources. What I did with that file is I created a couple pages on, or a couple folders on my Google Drive for the website. One is for the public, and one is just internal for the staff. And then within the public folder, you'd want to right click on this when you set it up and click share and then say anyone on the internet can find and view and there's all of these settings here that you can mess with uh, also clicking on advance and change allows you to set some of these sharing permissions on viewership and editing um, as you like so with this folder I set it up to where anyone could find and view uh, anything that goes in it Within that, I created an Announcements folder. And inside the Announcements folder, I dragged and dropped this file right here. Now, I wanted a little picture to go with the announcement on the main page, and that's why I used the Snipping tool, which is a Windows tool for taking screenshots. You can find that by going into Windows Start menu and clicking that and then typing the word Snip, and it's right there. And then getting a little picture here that I then clicked Save on and named it Turkey Drive. And you can see I've already saved that picture uh, to my desktop. So save the picture and then I'll use both this PDF now that's up on my Google Drive as well as that picture for the announcement. I'm going to go to the announcements page, click View More. Then I'm going to click New Post to create the new announcement. And this one we'll call Thanksgiving Community Resources. And let's check the date on that. Looks like it is November 19th. I want that in the title of the announcement. And I'm going to change the layout to the left sidebar. Inside this one, I'll put the picture, insert image, upload images. Off the desktop, I want the Thanksgiving, there it is, turkey drive picture. So that little picture will show up on the main page. Hit OK. Remove this link here to make the picture full size and then hit 100% so it'll align right there in that uh, little section and then I want to embed the PDF right here and in order to do that I open the PDF I double click on it I go over here to these three dots I say more actions and open in new window which seems kind of weird but then, after I've done that, and I click on the three dots, it will give me an embed item option. When I click that, it gives me HTML code that will embed the PDF into the page. And so I copied that code. I'm going back to this page. And here's where I want to embed the code. Now, if I do this, all that will show up is the text. So what I need to do is go to where it says HTML right here. And I'm just going to remove the extra line there and paste in that embed code uh, right there. I might need to change the width on this after I'm done. Let's check and see. Update. And save. And it's publishing right now. And there it is. Yeah, and it looks like it's a little too wide. 
So what I can do then is hit the pencil right here to edit this page, click on this gadget, click on the settings, change the width. It looked like it was just a little too big, so I'm going to change it some, from 640 to 600. Hit OK and save. Looks like it's still a little too big, so I'm going to go back through again. Lop another 50 off of it. Let's see what happens this time. And that's looking a bit better. I could probably edit it down one more time to get the gray frame looking nice and perfect around the edge of it, but I think I'm going to call it a day. Um, what's nice is there's the option for someone to be able to scroll down and see the PDF as well. If I wanted to, also down here, I could add the file for the uh, Thanksgiving Community Resources PDF to the bottom of the announcement for someone to download as well. So that's how you embed a PDF into uh, an announcement that you've made up on the website. And that's that.